Hey, what's going on, everyone? I hope you guys are doing well. It is a really nice Saturday right now. Got my walk in. I've been doing my 10,000 steps every day. So I've been very consistent so far in 2023, and there's no reason to believe that I will not continue being consistent as I have been. And I've been doing very, very, very well with not eating out and also with, you know, keeping my carbs low and not eating sweets and junk food and that kind of stuff. So today I just wanted to talk about a text I received a few months ago from a buddy of mine. He was asking me about investments, just asking for advice. And I told him the same thing I tell everybody else, you know, I'm comfortable putting everything into the total stock market index fund, whether that's VTSAX or FSKAX or FZROX. And it made me think about JT the Pocket Watcher's last live stream where he basically was reacting to the stock picks of Ian Dunlap and Earn Your Leisure. And how he was talking about nobody really is a good stock picker. That's why you should just do the index funds. And I've always agreed, you know, I believe that slow and steady wins the race and i also believe that none of us are smart enough to try to figure out what stock is going to be the next best thing you know we've talked about that i talked about that on a previous video but i also want to hit on something else i don't think i hit on it last time i did a video but as jt the pocket watcher says if it's not boring if it's too glitzy, too glamorous, you're probably doing too much. You're probably doing too much. Sustained excellence in the market and sustained earnings, long-term investing is boring. If you're trying to be successful in the long term, it needs to be boring. If it's too sexy, you ain't doing it right. You're doing too much. Remember that. Building wealth is boring. There's nothing really to it. Invest consistently, invest often, and invest what you can. Bottom line. And I think you just need to, to put that money into simple investments. Don't try to figure out you know, what's going to go up tomorrow because past performance is not necessarily going to be indicative of future performance. It can, but it's no guarantee. It's no guarantee. So always remember that. A lot of good information out there. I'm a huge fan of The Simple Path to Wealth by J.L. Collins. I have interviewed him multiple times and we had a really good live stream one time. And I just really believe that The Simple Path to Wealth is the best path to wealth nothing too complicated nothing too difficult just be consistent be consistent all right i appreciate you guys i hope that y'all have a great weekend and enjoy your mlk holiday regardless of what you're doing i'll be at a fraternity breakfast that day so i'm looking forward to that but hey y'all have a great weekend all right and be careful out there take care